Goyard. Michael Forrest. It's actually pretty nice too. Louis Vuitton. Actually in great condition too. Stay fine indeed. Yeah, you already know who your daddy is. right here is a 10 by 15 storage. I think this one in particular, I was in a bidding war and it went up to $100, which is a little too much than what I expected to pay. But for 10 by 15 and what I've seen through the photos, straight up, it looked like I got my money's worth off of the photos. So for ado, let's jump straight to the storage unit. Hopefully we find some gems. Let's get it. got here you guys it's a bunch of trash is what it seems but you know how it is with these storage units these people love to hide their Rugurgo belongings somewhere hidden in here so that's what we're about to chase after I already see some brother printers right here hopefully that they do work because like just one of these already paid for this whole entire storage so hopefully those on our point we got this little um seems like the old mannequin she really doesn't got no uh, accessories, but it's, it's whatever. 10, 15 dollars for this, 20 bucks. Like I said, we got over here three brother. I'm gonna take these bad boys home. Hopefully they work, cause that is some cheese. Each of them, I'm gonna put um, how much they're worth in the screen, but I'm guessing I'm getting at least like 30 to 100 dollars each. We'll see. Look like they all the same model too, which made me wonder, why the hell did they have three brother printers? Hmm. Over here, it seems like we got some mason jugs. Mason jars, yes. So, looks like we got all of them except for two. So, let's see if I can sell this whole box at least for $20 right there. If not, eh, throw it for 10 just, get, just to get rid of it. Whew. Got this little mini shelf. I'm gonna see if I can try to get rid of it, but if not, this is gonna be a whopping five bucks. Great, great. Who the goodies? Well, when I thought it was goodies, just got a bunch of cups and uh, glasses, wine glasses right here. Probably total value of 10 bucks. Another box here. Taped up. Not taped up enough for this. Got some more kitchen accessories. Probably gonna donate these. So, you know how it is. Uh, let's see. Uh, don't seem like it's anything really important in there, but clothes. Crazy because I literally had just got one of these and look. This right here, we know how equals is. $20 right there. So I had seen this thing right here in the listing. It actually caught my attention. Make sure it's not rattling or anything. It looks like some sort of like. We'll say karaoke, mini karaoke. Ah, uh, nailed it. Mini karaoke right here, portable. Just doesn't come with the mics, which kind of sucks. Or any plugs in that matter, but it seems like you could just power it pretty nicely. So let's see if I can uh, sell this baby right here. Got some other things here. So you got some books, bags, some good bags have most. This is spec. I've never seen a spec come out with some bags. Got a little mystery bag here. I wonder what's in here. Oh, I see cannon. Hold on. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. I could 
to you right now. This camera right here. You guys already know I made my money back already. <laughs> T3. Seems like it comes with the accessories too. Aha. Does charger, wipes, USB, everything you need. Perfect. iPhone, of course, they ain't gonna be their iPhone in here. Um, it's like a bunch of accessories. We're gonna look through this a little bit. Is this what I think it is? Oh, uh, just the trap. Some sort of candle lamp. In good condition too. Much of nothing. This person had a lot of bags. A jewelry box in here. Looks like upside down. Jewelry box with no jewelry. Nice. Looks like a charger some some sort, so it like it might be an encounter of a lot of maybe. They have Spectrum TV. That's really not about you, but what is this? Library of Congress? National Library Service for the Blind and Physical. Okay. Not know that I don't know if this is any value or anything, but do a little research on it. Putting like the trash away. It looks like this one's brand new, so this one's a good steal right here. These bags are kind of stale, but I'll probably donate them. On to the next bin. Uh, let's do this one. Uh, LED strips. Brand new in your box too. Yes, sir. Sack these. <laughs> um, looks like a long USB stick. Definitely gonna take that. Oh, you guys haven't seen one of these before. You guys don't know how good this feels. <laughs> Ooh, brand new staple. <sighs> Next spin, it seems. A bunch of bags. I say these this chick is obsessed with bags. Yes. Ooh, we got some nice ass Nikes. I'm not gonna lie. Uh 9.5. Find another pair. That's some that's some cheese. Some Tommy Hilfiger, got some Coach. Like this lady really was a fast, and they're actually good brands. Honestly, like I said, I really don't like messing with things like this, but we could see if we could probably donate. Let's see what we got in here. We got a little steamer. Pretty nice. I actually like the quality of this. We got some Armani exchange glasses. Nice. All right. What's this? Insect trap? And it's brand new. Is it? Yeah, it is brand new. Definitely gonna look into that. Uh, Michael Jackson. Guys, going to leave y'all cars. Look, I'm gonna be going to swipe town on this. <laughs> they left all their cars in here. <laughs> Bro, 
you want to know what's so crazy? After all these things and all these bags of shoes, like insane amount of shoes, like I'm talking about good shoes. Like look at this Converse, bro. Barely look like it's worn. Yo, guys, look at this. It's a freaking deep freezer in here. Like, yo, it just keeps getting better and better. I'm not gonna lie, this bin just looks so crazy. Like, I don't even know what this is. You guys tell me in the comments below, what the hell am I looking at? This looks crazy. This one look a fire. This actually looks pretty good. I need one of these too. Perfect. It's like a, a mini printer. That is fire. Uh, again, a bunch of bags. Like, oh. you guys that's just pretty insane trying to take a little peek of what's behind oh man it's gonna be a long day long day a little longer than a few minutes later and it's actually like brand new shoes this is the thing I get some good quality shoes in here. Ooh, what's in here? We look like we got a laminator? Or is this just a vacuum seal? Hmm. Oh, this thing says this worth. Ooh, that's actually a pretty nice vacuum. Cha-ching! Uh, some sort of time. Did some cleaning around, removing a few things. But it seems like there's a freaking couch just hitting right here. Like I didn't even see this in the listing. Thought it was all straight clothes. And as you guys can see here, looks like we got a TV. Uh oh. All right, but let's get into this bin right here. That's the only way we can do this by bin by bin. Whew. Already getting hot in here. They got a little scale right here. It looks like that one is beat, so it's probably trash. This one, same condition, beat, trash as well. I keep finding these little like pole things. That means we're, we're, we're gonna encounter a drill or something else because there's a battery pack. I remember these. And we encounter our first watch. Looks like it's fake. I'm not gonna lie. Definitely fake. I don't even know how to charge it. Imitating the Apple Watch. Garbage. I'm finding more and more of these uh, remotes. Uh, calculator. This is for the, the printer. Cool. cool. That's 
footage. There we go. Oh, and we found the mics. Oh, and it still turns on. That's fire. That's fire. Oh, we about to get lit. We about to get lit. So one thing I'm going to tell you guys, you never throw away wires. You never know when you're going to find something that's compatible for that bad boy. It looks like we got some sort of lens. Don't keep that. That means we're going to capture something in here. Umbrellas. My girls are just don't know, so I'm going to just hold on to the umbrellas. SD card. Nice. Great. Back down in here, we have some sort of light thing. Don't know what the hell that is. Garbage. Binoculars. 64 gigs. Stay hitting. Uh, got a bunch of bands for these weird America Exchange. Never heard of that. Bunch of fake jewelry. What is this? Yeah. Okay. Looks like this whole thing is a uh, bag. God damn. I can see why you needed. Oh, that's Michael Kors. That's what I'm saying. They actually got some good bags in here. Louis Vuitton? Actually in great condition too. If it's real, it's, it's lit. I find all types of designers in here. What is this? A mobile printer. Oh yeah. We about to turn up. Got this little chest right here more fake jewelry but this chest is pretty fire i'm not gonna lie i might keep it all right finally got two to freaking back all of these seems to be like clothes but i'm still gonna go through them but we just got kitchen items and stuff like that really nothing just like interesting honestly frozen treat maker i've never seen this ever in my life so i don't know this, this could be a good keeper but majority of this stuff seems like it's going to be donated so we are just going to move everything here and see if we can get to the back so we can see if we can find anything else yo guys so i just removed this mattress and look what your boy done found no way we got a little fitness bicycle right here it looks like it's missing the arm hopefully i can find it but other than that bro that is a definite one we got this little mini um i don't know what the hell you can call this let me pull up my flash real quick all right, here we go. So you guys can get a better look at what I'm looking at. It looks like some ancient, it looks ancient to me, fossilized antique ladder right here. Thing is sliding, I'm not gonna lie. Just so you guys can get a better look at what I'm looking at. But it looks like all these bins that are right here in the middle are just like food and stuff. And it seems like the rest of the back is straight, just shoo. <laughs> straight donation i'm gonna look through them just a little bit but um, i'm probably just gonna show you guys just the highlights or whatever what i find but we're gonna hit these boxes right here let's hit box number one right here looks like it's part of it's part of the brother printers it seems like because it got like these i want to say these are like the ink maybe placement parts knows but we got a bunch of them it's perfect for us to test and it looks like what i'm looking at is a little speaker if i'm not mistaken it seems like people love buying this thing you guys won't imagine how much of these i just sold insane so we got some headphones what brand we got some scolies oh that's fire that's fire i might i might keep those for myself Got a little dump kit. This is a fire. This is like a little poster kit for you. Post it. Excuse me, I guess. Post it kit for like your little um things. I don't know what this is. Oh, these are like these to file your nails. Uh, hands free can opener. What? 
got a Logitech um, little mouse. You know, you guys definitely going in. I'm not gonna lie, she low key bad. <laughs> you guys don't understand. I really need this. All right, let's move on to the next box. Pretty nice to hold on to that. Turn my mouse at the game, boost. We gonna move on through this. Mall. All right, ooh, your boy done see some Javinci. Now is it real Javinci though? Goyard. I could have swore this was like a Javinci little prints. Uh, I'm checking the authenticity to it. Got another Michelle Obama. Oh, she must have been obsessed with her because this whole box Michelle Obama. We got a little Coleman for emergencies. I'm not going to lie. I might just keep this bad boy right here. Take batteries? Oh, yes, sir. And I'm all and light up. Let there be light. Tell you what the hell this is. You got some guests. Just a bunch of randoms. I think that's it for this box right here. Seems like this box is just bullshit. Yep, it's a bunch of papers and stuff. Oh, almost knocked the boy over. It looks like they just threw their whole life in here. That is crazy. Yo, how many flashlights did they need it? They must have really been in emergencies. I'm not gonna lie, I might have to keep a few of these. Stay finding these, you know, every time we see it. Oh, that thing say daddy. Yeah, you already know who your daddy is. All right, let's get to this box right here. Seems like your boy got a stereo. Okay, okay. Them boys were jamming too. Let me see, can you inject this? I might have to check to see if this bad boy work, but this is like them old school speakers. 10 bucks, honestly. Not really much that you could sell on there. All right, so looks like we got, oh man, Foley was in good condition. I could have sold this right here. Let's, Let's see what they got hiding up in here. Drive, y'all can smell what I'm smelling. Oh, my hand is all over it too. <laughs> see this one it's a hard case so that means they trying to protect something they trying to protect something in here uh, yeah just close 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 if only these were Uggs, I would have kept them, but these are some no-name brand used nasty ass <laughs> codes. So, hey. Total donation pile. Travel cases can easily go from like 20 to $30 just each, especially this hard one right here. Uh, and it looks like this was what was hiding this whole time. Look at that, guys. We got a massive TV right here. Good condition, pretty. It looks like it's up to date too. It looks like it was pretty recent. Probably not 4K though. Definitely not 4K. But good look at TV. I'm gonna have to test it out. But just as is, you know, probably let it go for a good like 50, 60 bucks. We'll see. I gotta find a remote though. I'm not gonna lie, this painting right here it looks handmade. So it's really good. It got a signature over here. I'm actually do some research and see if this is actually pretty popular or valuable. Check if there's any tags in the back. All right, yeah, so this is actually legit, legit. So definitely do my research because there was one photo that I had passed up in the flea market 
and then they were selling it for 20 bucks. And then once I got home and reviewed my videos and actually did some research, that thing was worth almost three bands. It was crazy, <laughs> but yeah. So guys, always be in mind when you see photos like this, especially with signatures and stuff and they legit, make sure they don't got no stickers, not on no good, goodwill or anything. Do your research because you might be holding on some, some money. Speaking of money. Yeah, $9. This is what I'm talking about. Why is she have a bunch of clocks? Like, it's not even opened. They just had a they just had a clock. I'm not gonna lie, you guys. This is a lot to go through. Stuff in my hand in the bottom it doesn't seem like there's anything solid behind here. It's just straight bags. Oh, by the way, my mom is here. She's also helping me. Say hi to the video guy. Hi, how are you? <laughs> how is everybody? But yeah, uh, looks like we got a heated uh. Got a heated mat of some sort. Doesn't look really good. I'm not really gonna be interested in reselling that, so we're probably gonna toss that out. Basura! What the? Bro, they got a wheel in here. And it's just a wheel, not even the rim. It's just a wheel, y'all. That is so random. All right, I'm really interested in this box here. So, uh, I'm gonna lift it up. I see Santa. So it's probably some Christmas BS. Yeah. Figure. Oh, this is actually good quality, bro. Y'all, y'all need to see this. Hold on. Damn, look at my boy Santa. <laughs> Santa. My boy looking fresh up in here, man. What you been doing out here, bro? You're supposed to be sending out some Christmas presents. I haven't seen you in years. You just over here duck dog like right that. <laughs> This is a bunch of Christmas BS. Yeah, Let's see. I'm gonna just leave it right here. People will go on, people gonna buy these. Got a sauce tray. Like I cannot cap with y'all. I just hit like five bags and it doesn't even look like we just hit an inch of this, man. Honestly, I just want to give up and just donate these just blindsided, but who knows what'd be in here. This lady hid a freaking camera inside one of these bags. So who knows what else is in here? All right, so we hit some sort of thing. This thing says Kage Q. The hell is that? A portable grill that goes where the action is. is. Chrome propane grill? Is it actual grill? Oh shit. Got some chairs. We got a little mini table in here. This table actually pretty cool. So I don't that real and then it looks like we got some sort of weird painting. Hey, somebody gonna like it. Hey, Mito. All right, you guys, I just separated the storage now. Everything in the right side and on the back. It's literally trash, everything on the left side. So like all these purses and stuff, I think I'm just gonna swing by the flea market. Like even this designer one too, just bring it to the flea market and just sell it one by one just for the low. Um, all these mats and stuff, uh, I said mats, <laughs> I suck. All these luggage bags, they're empty, so I'm gonna sell that. Yeah, so just everything on the left, I'm pretty much gonna sell, which brings our storage to about a good 30% yield, which, uh, man, I mean, I'm giving it upper 40% or 40% yield just because of the camera. The camera was pretty good. For $100, I think this was a rad storage to go for. With all the designer bags, I definitely made my money back 10 times. Even though most of them, I didn't even know the brand name or whatever the case was, they still flew off the shelves. I have plenty of storage videos that's coming out, trying to post at least every Friday around six o'clock. So stay tuned for more. I'm gonna leave you guys with this quote over here. Until the next video, happy hunting.